Hey guys, how you doing? Good? That is good. This video is sponsored by Established Titles. Established Titles is a fun and novel way to preserve the natural woodlands of Scotland while helping global reforestation efforts. It is a project based on a historic Scottish custom where land owners are referred to as lords and ladies. So that means when you work with established titles, everybody has to call you a lord or a lady, including your spouse. Right, baby? Lord, babe. Lord, babe. That's my name in this house now. Thank you. And my son soon will be calling me Lord Daddy. The title pass gives you at least one square foot of dedicated land on a private estate in Edelston, Scotland, and an official certificate. You know when there's a crest, it's official. And with every order, a tree is planted. They work with global charities, one tree planted and trees for the future. And with all of this, when you become a lord or a lady, you can change your name officially on your credit card, plane tickets, etc. The first 200 people to use my promo code to buy a title pack will effectively be next to my land. Guys, I don't think you're thinking about this. If you guys go and buy a title pack, we all gonna be around the same area. That means we are going to have a Nowusu kingdom, okay? We are going to have a kingdom, and that means I'm king, right? Check this out. Established Titles is actually running an early Black Friday sale. Plus, if you use my promo code Clifford, you'll get an additional 10% off so go to establishedtitles.com backslash clifford and become a lord or a lady <laughs> Clifford I need help yeah I know mean by that? No, Dad, I meant, um, how can I help you? You, this boy, nowadays you have really been living outside of your skin. Dad, what does that mean? You have some nerve. <laughs> anyway, Crawford, I need your help. What's up? Okay, so I was outside minding my business, cleaning the front yard. When our neighbor started looking at me some way that I wasn't liking. You know he doesn't pay my bills. He doesn't pay the mortgage for this house. So why is he looking at me like that? So I looked at him back and I asked him, what are you looking at? Wait, dad, why would you ask him that? Hey, he was watching me some watching that I wasn't liking. Yeah, but, but still. Hey, you know, I am no punk. Yeah, but. Okay. Anyway, after I asked him, hey, what are you looking at? He looked at me and said, nothing much. Hey. So I pointed at myself just to make sure it was me he was talking to. I pointed at myself and I said, me, Kujo Owusu, Kujo Ku, are you saying I am nothing much? He said, yes. And what are you going to do about it? Quiffer, I pointed at him. I pointed at him like this. And I said, you, I will beat you, okay? I will beat you. Dad, Dad, you said all of that? Quifford, I said even more than that, okay? While I was pointing at him, I said, I will beat you so bad that your life will reset so you can learn manners. Hey, because you, if you think you are somebody, me, I am somebody other than you. So what you're telling me is, you fought our neighbor? Oh, no, Quifford, that's where I need your help. Okay, so when I was telling him all this and I'm going to beat him, all of a sudden, his son came out to assist him. Crawford, put on your shoes and let's go. Wait, wait, Dad, which neighbor are you talking about? Crawford, the neighbor across the street. Dad, the neighbor with the giant son that plays football. Yes, that one, the one with the, the tall son, the one that's real big, like, like, um, The Rock. Oh no, Dad, I can't help you with this one. No way. Eh? What do you mean? Dad, you always tell me to stay out of trouble and mind my own business. I am obeying you. I'm staying out of this one. Dad, 
This doesn't concern me. Crayford, Nana, Kwame, Owusu, don't be a punk. Put on your shoe and let's go. Let's go and defend the Owusu family. If I go out there with you, they will beat us to death and there will be no Owusu family left. Hey, Crayford, I can't believe that you are going to allow me to go out there by myself. Dad, you won't be by yourself. You always say that the Spirit of God is your strength. Please, call the Spirit of God to go out with you. Hey, wow. Dad, Dad, let me remind you. You always say that you never have to fight your own fight because God will fight your battles for you. So please, Dad, let's pray so that God can go and fight this battle because I'm not going outside to fight a battle that I didn't start. All of a sudden, you are prayerful, prayer warrior, strong in your faith, weak in reality. This was just a test. I was testing you to see if you had my back the same way I have your back. Look at this picture. You know why your mom is smiling like that? Because I have her back. Look how I'm standing behind her with my arms around her, protecting her, okay? I have her back. Not so long ago, you Crayford, you got beat up by that tall boy that looked like a man. Who came to defend you? Me. I came to defend you because I'm no punk. But when it's my turn, you are telling me that we should pray and God will go and fight. Eh? Okay. Okay. No problem. I'm very happy to know who you really are. I am scared. If I'm not here, so you are telling me you can't defend your mother? You can't hold this house down? Crayford, no problem. I'm happy I know now. I am going to strengthen you up. We are going to train you so you can be strong and be no punk so you can be strong like your father. Stand up. Stand up. Okay, put your hands like this. Good. Now, squat down and up. Keep doing that. We are going to build your thighs and your legs so you can stand firm and strong. After that, you are going to do some push-ups so we can build your upper body just in case you need to defend your mother or me or somebody else in this house. Always remember, in the Bible, even though God was with David and he was his strength, David still had to go and fight Goliath. He still had to go and fight, okay? Prayer without action is nothing. That's faith. Come on. Uh, I know they want the best for me, but I want to be free. I know they want the best for me, but I wanna be free, free to do whatever I want. One hour free to do whatever I want, free to do whatever I like, free to live my life.